Hello, I'm Lucy Schultz, Area Superintendent of the Ryan High School Zone, also known as Home of Champions. I am so incredibly grateful to get to work alongside these amazing educators each and every day. Let's meet our Ryan High School Zone Teachers of the Year. Andrea Byers, Jennings Elementary. Andrea Byers is completing her 34th year in education and her eighth year working in Denton ISD. She has served as a third grade self-contained teacher at Jennings Elementary for the past two years. From a young age, Ms. Byers always knew she wanted to be a teacher. Ms. Byers views her job as much more than just teaching students, and she strives every day to nurture and care for each of the children in her classroom. Above all else though, Ms. Byers cherishes the lessons her students learn and take with them, leading to their successes later in life. Brenda Gonzalez, Hodge Elementary School. Brenda Gonzalez is finishing her sixth year in education, all of which have been in Ditton ISD as a fourth grade bilingual teacher at Hodge Elementary. As a child, Ms. Gonzalez experienced several hardships and did not speak English when she and her family moved to the United States. However, through her own education in Ditton ISD, Ms. Gonzalez found her passion for teaching and says she always had an educator who believed in her. That support is what fuels her teaching today as she strives to instill resilience in her students to help them develop confidence, self-efficacy, and perseverance. Kelly Golden, Lagrone Academy. Kelly Golden is completing her fourth year in education and in Denton ISD, all of which have been as the graphic design and illustration teacher at the Lagrone Academy. A product of Denton ISD, Ms. Golden took the same class at Lagrone that she now teaches. She says it was her relationship with her own teacher that inspired Ms. Golden to one day follow in her footsteps. Ms. Golden's goal is to lead with empathy and respect, just like her teacher at Lagrone did, and support her students any way she can. Melissa Shalacy, Myers Middle School. Melissa Shalacy is finishing her 11th year in education and eighth year as a special education teacher at Myers Middle School. Ms. Shalacy has spent her entire career in Ditton ISD, and over the last decade, has been committed to building relationships with all of her students. This philosophy is what ultimately guides her teaching as she strives to develop and connect with her students to improve their education. Ms. Shalacy says one of the most rewarding parts of teaching is when students remember or call upon her years after they have left her class. Kamitra Whitby, Pecan Creek Elementary School. Kamitra Whitby is completing her eighth year as an inclusion teacher at Pecan Creek Elementary. Ms. Whitby describes her job as the most meaningful career on earth, and she shares that passion and dedication each day with her students. It was Ms. Whitby's passion that led her to help create an academic sensory room at Pecan Creek, which provides a space for students to participate in activities that would not be possible in an ordinary classroom. Through the use of this academic sensory room, Ms. Whitby has helped Pecan Creek increase student attentiveness and academic progress in all areas. Courtney Starks, Rivera Elementary School. Courtney Starks is finishing her eighth year in education and third year as a first grade teacher at Rivera Elementary School. A graduate of Ditton ISD, Ms. Starks was born and raised in Ditton. After completing her first year of teaching in 2016-2017, Ms. Stark's infant son unexpectedly passed away. Ms. Stark's credits her son for not only introducing her to a love for children, but also further igniting her passion for education. Ms. Stark's devotes every day to helping shape the future by believing in each of her students. She believes each of her students can succeed, and watching them succeed is Ms. Stark's greatest reward. Trey Spalding, Ryan High School. Trey Spalding is completing 
his 27th year in education and 13th year as a biology teacher at Ryan High School. Mr. Spalding starts each of his days with a hypothesis. What will make me an exceptional teacher for my students? Over the years, Mr. Spalding has found developing genuine connections with his students is the key to being the best teacher possible. In addition, Mr. Spalding utilizes a variety of tools like storytelling, hands-on activities, and labs to help students make connections with challenging biology concepts. And while seeing his students understand biology is important, ultimately, Mr. Spalding wants his students to know they have a connection with someone who always believes in them. Kim Skink, Schultz Elementary. Kim Skink is completing her 25th year in education and 16th year as a first grade dual language teacher at Schultz Elementary. Ms. Skink's mantra each day is make goals, reach goals, and celebrate them. Her goal is to bring learning to life for her students, whether it be through singing a song or dancing. Through this way of teaching, Ms. Skink works tirelessly to create memories for her students, which then turn into the catalyst for their learning. As Ms. Skink describes, her job is not only grow lifelong learners who want to explore, but also make a positive impact on their world around them. Ashley Goldsmith Everett, Stevens Elementary. Ashley Goldsmith Everett is finishing her 17th year in education and sixth year as a kindergarten teacher at Stevens Elementary. Ms. Goldsmith Everett's philosophy of teaching centers around each student learning at a different pace and in different ways. She refers to her class as her school family and greets all of her students daily at the door to create a welcoming, safe environment. Ms. Goldsmith Everett believes when students are heard, loved, and valued, they perform at their best. Danielle Martinez, Strickland Middle School. Danielle Martinez is finishing her sixth year as a seventh grade science teacher at Strickland Middle School. Ms. Martinez loves igniting her students' curiosity about the world around them, which is something she gets to do every day as a science teacher. She believes in student-centered learning and strives to create an inclusive, engaging learning environment where students are active participants in their learning. Ms. Martinez says her biggest reward is seeing her students' light bulb moments, knowing that she was able to positively impact their future. Congratulations to all of our Ryan High School Zone Teachers of the Year. Thank you for what you do for our students each and every day.